good day to you all out there i hope your day is going pleasant and beautiful and right now on uh, the on the, the this is the program insurance and you on radio global and um i am i and i Amy, i'm the host for this program and we are going to be talking about health insurance today we are going to be i'm going to be talking about health insurance today and i have um a guest in the house and and our name is mrs mrs victor um miriam victoria Oladi oladili and she has been in um, insurance for seven years and um, we are going to be talking about health insurance and um, the importance and everything that um, why we should get um, health insurance the provisions of the law that um, um, encourages health insurance and um, the weeks involved in not, of not having in not having um, your health insurance and um, the types um, different um, products of the health insurance that um, are available to um us or everyone out there listening so it is insurance and you on radio global it is insurance and you on radio global and we are talking out insurance so i want to welcome the guests in the studio mrs miriam thank you so much for coming today all right then ah she has a really pleasant voice i must say <laughs> all right so um you said you've been in insurance for seven years you've been in insurance for seven years so definitely you know your onions as it is when it comes to that uh so what exactly is health insurance thank you health insurance basically is a type of insurance coverage that pays for medicals and surgical expenses that are incurred by the insured. Okay. It pays for medical, medical expenses, expenses that are incurred by the insured. That are incurred by the insured. Yes. Wow. Okay. So that's what um health insurance is. Yes. Uh, and also, you know, it can it pays the health insurance can either reimburse the insured for expenses incurred from illness or injury mm -hmm. you understand or pay the care provider that is the hospital okay yes that um um sorry the hospital that render the service the a service to the insured okay so it's either they pay the care providers yes. um or the uh the hospital or the health um, institution that provides the service of taking care of the insured yes. or they give the money to the insured yes, that or the money if the person has already paid the hospital bills okay him or okay and he has evidences to prove it should be like the receipts and others okay how does one qualify to uh, um get an health insurance get a health insurance yeah it's working in variety in variety in various ways okay thanks to our president good luck Evelyn Jonathan, which passed the what was the um health bill health insurance bill mm. last december 2014 we understand that basically every citizen of nigeria mm -hmm. should have an health insurance scheme mm -hmm. working for them and sadly few only few about seven percent of nigerians have a national health insurance scheme mm -hmm. recently but we hope to be here that before the year runs out we would have record an increase in that number mm -hmm. so so a lot of people do not really have this health insurance people do not people are not really uh, moved or motivated to get um, health insurance why do you think this is yeah basically you know from the time past most people doesn't really believe in insurance it's just now because of um, some bills that have been passing to law that each and individual should have and insurance mm -hmm. now these are a kind of an i hope not let's take it from this point look at the and the advanced world like the europe the america mm -hmm. you know you don't need to persuade any member or any citizen mm -hmm. to have 
the insurance. Yes. You understand? Because they are known to what they stand to benefit. What they stand to benefit, yes. From this scheme. And you know now in Nigeria, thank God for the um the, the, the recent bills at the, 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 the reform part that persuade Nigerians you know to embark on um health insurance. Okay. And this guy you can you can actually get this either by applying it for, by yourself mm -hmm. you understand go to a near uh, nearby hospital mm -hmm. that accredited mm. by the ministry of health mm -hmm. because before an hospital can be qualified it has to be accredited have the basic amenities mm. that actually provide for the needs of the insured okay so and we have some various um organizations mm -hmm. That when you um sorry when you secure a job in a standard organization, health insurance are part of the package you're being given. Mm. Like I am also a beneficiary of that. So you can either acquire it as an individual or from an organization, mm -hmm. or from uh just like I said earlier. From a company mm. or even non-government organization mm. they to uh, design this in order to learn as and give into the uh, to the society so whereby making um it um benefits as in um sorry it uh care as in available to her mm. yeah wow well, that that's interesting that's interesting. I well, people are not really so enlightened about it, but I'm sure um, it is. She has said it that individuals are working towards it to ensure that um, they provide health care benefits and services to um, all to everybody who um, mostly for the people who can have afford it, but even for all those who can afford it, it's still a form of insurance. So when it comes to um, providing health insurance for people is it because for um what i know it's okay once you are ill or you need a major treatment or something you you the insured gets um a uh, 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 sum of amount or his health bills are paid but the thing is what's in for the insurance company how do they get to run it as a business because i know that insurance companies are opened up as businesses so what uh, what are the terms and conditions or how does it run for one to be able to have a health insurance thank you Amy, for that question that's a wonderful question you know basically like we said earlier insurance is a pool of fund Mm. About we gather, let's take it from an individual perspective now. Individual having an air tissue mm. scheme. No, we go out there, we go on air sometime, we go on interpersonal um, conversing, telling people about the needs to have an air insurance scheme. Mm -hmm. Even the doctors, they accredited as features. You can see some of the um, signage, um, the, the um, signing the sign boards telling every individual every of their customers about nhr heads they get the money you know there is a certain amount of money mm -hmm. that is that are expected to be paid either monthly quarterly half yearly or annually into the health insurance plan Thank you. Understand. And we have seen that everybody cannot fall sick at the same time. Mm. You get that. Then, so if there is any eventuality in terms of sickness, mm -hmm. you understand the, uh, the, 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 the bills is being taken care of because we have larger fund. Mm. Because people are contributing monthly, quarterly, half yearly, and half yearly, as earlier st stated. Mm -hmm. So these are ways uh, insurance companies get their money through premiums, mm. premiums collection. Through premium collections. Yes. So what are the various forms of um, um, health insurance products? Because I, I know that in, in insurance they call it products that are available for people who are interested in it. Yeah. Oh, we have NHIS. 
which is at national level. We have HMO. Okay. We have different. How does the HMO variety. work? Yeah, HMO is usually affiliated to um, companies. You understand? Those are the eight. Um, sorry. You're trying to remember the acronym, right? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I think I will come back. I will probably okay. Yeah, no problem. So it is a it's an um health insurance scheme too. Yes, you understand. And we have different um people that handles it. Okay. We have um a marina maternity mm -hmm. service. Mm -hmm. We call it MMS, and you know we have various of them that are affiliated with one hospitals or the other. Mm -hmm. On that the the the, 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 the um our like environment. You understand? So. In case there is um probably uh, an applicant, I would like call it a worker is sick. You know, you can surely choose the nearest one mm -hmm. to your home mm -hmm. because when you are construing um, picking as in choosing and hospital, you should think about the nearness in case of any emergency. Yes. Like myself, I have to choose a place close to my uh, vicinity. You understand? So in case if there is any emergency, you have to get to clinic on time. Yes. Make sure of our road mm. you know you can it's, you can actually predict yes so okay and the various products are available all right so i'm working with some um, um an health insurance um an insurance company um for the company you work in what are the products available for people who want to insure themselves how is the what are the terms and conditions what are the what's the premium like and what how often do they have to pay the premium and what's their entitlement for whatever you know there are different types of you know it's for me it's pretty complex when i want to think about health insurance is okay it is um they add the it's at it has a it is at the incident of death that the person gets his money according to be it over a period of time if you have probably paid a bulk amount when it started and it doesn't have to probably pay i know the, there are different products anyway according ah, yeah, to different okay. different yes. um, insurance companies now for else something can happen to someone be it accident be it um spilling of um factory accidents be it motor accidents be it um kidney failure i don't know it's really complicated when it comes to health so how are you able to cover that up how are you able to your insurance company where you're working how do how do you people do that how do you people clearly state it okay for this it's this for this it's that or do you put it in do you put some in some category in one category and put some in another category or something i don't understand just enlighten yeah, the we public have, we have various package when it comes to hmo when it comes to health insurance okay we have various package mm -hmm. there is one that is called basic there is family package and there are other names that are given to others too that covers the surgical expenses yes yes and just like how um, these are that say you cut your clothes according to your clothes you understand mm. those that you can actually afford so if, if you can afford the basic fine mm -hmm. you can afford the others to fine mm -hmm. you understand and sorry you made mention of um, sorry Hey, ooh, whoa, what 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 I, I i said that um i don't know how it is categorized when it comes to the various that for when it comes to else there's there's so many things that can happen one can have his hand amputated yeah. if he works in a factory one yeah. can probably have an accident driving home one can uh, probably have um fire burns one is probably in his heart got burnt and he was at home or probably choking in elevation of smoke yeah. you know there are various type of things so how do how do you cover that in your insurance yeah, we company have what we call personal accident insurance personal accident insurance okay yes. like this is uh, the premium you pay is relatively low and you, you know it gives you a uh, hospital coverage of ten thousand naira and hundred thousand era just like um these are um, the, the the kind of packages ads are introduced mm. they partner with um was it crusader insurance 
that and when you when you pay up to about a thousand a month you covered i do have that too you understand you are covered mm. for um hospital hospital bills of ten thousand and um in case of any eventuality of hundred thousand era mm. but in the insurance in its actual sense you can actually get more than that it depends on what you want you understand mm -hmm. so probably if you want uh, something that can give you some assured of um, 100 million you can actually have that mm -hmm. just like that of um, 10,000 era hospital B and 100,000 era eventuality is just 1,000 era per annum you can see that it's very very affordable you yeah. understand and in case if there is um, an emergency you understand and you don't really have cash at hand you know these are the benefits that are open to you. Wow. So, um, and when is there a, like what I said, the terms and conditions? When is there a breach? Like, okay, for instance, just give us one instance of um, a, a health insurance policy and the terms and conditions or the things that would happen that would say, okay, you are not qualified for this, um, for the remittance of your money or yeah in a, i quite understand that you know just like in insurance no premium no cover you understand basically the um the idea of insurance generally is the way how you know when you um you, when you start a particular policy you are expected to pay your premium as at when due. Mm -hmm. So when you don't do that, definitely under that period of time you are not covered. Mm. So probably if you are on monthly um, premium, uh, let's say now today is um, probably you pay for uh, for a particular year, uh, let's say 2015 and then you didn't pay for 2016 mm -hmm. and something happened in 2017 mm. you're not covered wow so you have just like the, the the general slogan no premium no cover no premium no cover so that is just the terms of condition because i i know for for car insurance it's they, they investigate into the matter is you are the cause of the accident you do not get a cover even if you've had your insurance and all of that so now when it comes to health insurance how would one investigate into a matter of um let's just say um kidney failure or something you know that is something that ha that is that is very very sensitive yes and you can't actually say there are some exception exceptional cases that you can't even when it comes to insurance naturally you mm -hmm. can't tell with it you can't say oh because it is the cost of this we are not going to handle this mm -hmm. no because even uh for for doctors as a their hope states that they must try as much as possible to, to save, save, lives. save, save lives so we don't just go into investigating probably is uh is an fe um sorry every alcohol drinker drinker you know intake and all that basically we try as to attend to them needs to, to at, their at needs. that particular time mm -hmm. and before uh, we embark on um, uh, on this insurance you know on this package you, we have something uh we have what we call kyc as you know your customer okay you understand and then there are some questions that we ask you understand to actually tell us particularly who this person is you mm. understand is it a, 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 a chain smoker mm. you understand is it is it, is it an every in uh, does it take every does it have an uh every uh alcohol intake mm -hmm. you understand does it take narcotics and all so then if you know that this uh is exposed to all this risk then we try to inflate the premium mm. You understand so that if they need their rights we don't have to you know shy away from our responsibility okay because basically insurance is guiding you against a risk that might occur mm. you understand so 
all right so oh well we're going to go on this short musical break we're going to go on this uh, um, take some commercials and we would be back with the program insurance and you and then we have been talking with mrs mary maryam oladele and uh, she has been in insurance for seven years and uh, we are talking health insurance for today how you can show yourself the terms and conditions of various products and services afforded to you so don't go nowhere we will be right back one naira what is one naira i can send sms's as low as one naira per sms at www.smsafricang.com tell me something i just need to buy sms africa scratch that register for free at www.smsafricang.com click on the buy sms and enter the pin number click on add then sms credits will be added to my balance and i can send as many messages as i want to multiple contacts and i get fast deliveries within seconds and i can schedule my messages for daily and for weekly wonderful i need to be a part of it for more inquiries you can call 081-37-30-5646 SMS Africa in minutes you're welcome back to the program it is out and it is insurance and you and we have been talking about health insurance we've been talking about the importance of health insurance we've been talking about how it works okay and how it um it is beneficial to the people who um take this health insurance who ins- ensure that they are insured and um she has made um mrs um uh, miriam miriam olade um who is our guest for today she has said that um even for else it is a very sensitive issue you do not they do not get to go through the rigorous tax of having to investigate because it is an issue of life and death issue of time it is time sensitive you know one should be careful of how much um you um how how, how long you delay when it comes to that and the people are attended to and um you know honors falls on them to attend to these people and care for them to keep them in stable condition before um, one goes into the long process of um, having to verify this and that and they have uh, the KYC you know your customer before they yes to know your customer before and they actually start out the insurance um, policy and get it working and running for them so um it uh and she mentioned that um there are provisions in law that every 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 citizen of the country um passed by the president that every citizen of the country should have the nhis and the H- nhis is national health insurance scheme right uh and for that people pay how much are people to even pay a year relatively low depending on the package in which they have okay they have the basic, we have family we have yeah okay so it's relatively low i because i know of um um someone his wife put to bed and i asked okay how much did the hospital bills cost um he actually went to university um general um um, university teaching hospital and she put to bed there and i asked how much he said was it 600 naira he said he paid he said it was was it no was this 600 or 6000 i I can't really remember but he said 6000 naira per month which can cover you for like uh, over 500 000. no he said the bill for taking them to the hospital taking care of the mother and the baby for the delivery bills okay he yes. said it was it about six thousand or six hundred he said it was just ten percent ten percent of the cost he had to pay because they were covered um for yes, the nhis for the nhis, yes. NHIS yes. so so they pay just ten percent and i was like wow yes. wow that's, that's Actually, happens that people out of ignorance mm-hmm. you know, those things, you know, probably they are not really well enlightened about the importance mm-hmm. of insurance scheme. So, probably before the year runs out, we are putting up some measures mm-hmm. whereby we can actually create the awareness, yeah, that you don't really have to 
pay that much. Yes. To get covered. Yeah, you don't have to pay that much. I was really impressed because thinking about it, it will probably be for while she was going for antenatals. She must have been paying how much? How much would it have been that she must have paid throughout? And she she got that which slash ninety percent off. Yes. When you are covered, you don't need to pay for any antenatal bills, you know, all these are included in the package. So, to the extent of delivery, even going to, you know, some women, you know, they might not probably, because of their uh, nature, they might be subjected to um, CS. Yes, like even for the CS. The so, we still cover CS, 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 right? Yes. Wow, that's impressive. So, so now you see the importance, not just for pregnant women, also for other cases. You might probably want to do, even if it's a minor surgery of appendicitis or something, even if it's a surgery, a corrective surgery or something. That also covers it. It also covers it. Wow. We've learned quite a lot um, today on the program, um, um, health and insurance, and you and we've been talking about health insurance with Mrs. Marian um, or Ladili. And... Um, We'll, we have run out of time and we'll have to wrap up the show right now so um, we learned quite a lot and we learned um, the importance of various um, types of products uh, under the health insurance and the provisions and the terms and conditions also and um, how it works really and we've, we just talked about the NHIS the, we talked also about the HMO you know for companies who want to cover for their staff and all of that well it has been an enlightening moment on uh, insurance and you on Radio Global and I want to say a big thank, thank you to our guest thank you Amy <laughs> all right so with that we wrap up the show for today so do make it a date with us same time same station here on Radio Global and we will be talking insurance so don't go nowhere. Stay tuned to Radio Global. We'll be bringing you more programs. I am Ini. So stay tuned. It's Radio Global, redefining your radio experience.